I haven't used the full potential of my Sony ZB-810 camera for so long when I got this camera in the beginning. And suddenly I realized that if I record my video using log picture profile, suppose S-Log2 or S-Log3 or HLG, then it can record much better video rather than recording it in a standard picture profile. So today I'm going to show you how you can easily color grade your S-Log footage using Adobe Premiere Pro. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. So here in Adobe Premiere Pro, I have already inputted two different video. I'll give a link in the description below. You can download the footage and you can practice along with me. So I have recorded this video using standard picture profile and this video have been recorded using picture profile 8, which is S-Log3, right? So if I click and drag this here on my timeline, you'll see the video is already processed. I mean, the camera has already introduced contrast, saturation and sharpness here on this footage but if i click and drag this s-log3 footage you'll see the footage is looking so dull it is looking very washed out so how you can color grade this s-log3 video in adobe premiere pro to color correct and color grade log footage first you need to convert that footage in standard picture profile. so the camera has recorded the video using s-log3 right if you want to uh, color grade it you can sim simply you can just increase the sharpness then saturation contrast it will look okay but it will not look best right if i just uh, down the shadow a little bit if i down the black a little bit here from the lumetri color panel if you don't see lumetri color panel always you can go to window then lumetri color then this panel will appear and here you can just eyeball the footage and change the different parameter right i'm just decreasing the highlight a little bit shadow a little bit more then i'll increase the exposure a little bit again white decrease and from here you can introduce sharpness and you can introduce saturation or vibrance right so it is looking okay right if i show you the before this is the before this is the after but if you use a conversion LUT, it will make your job much easier right so let's reset all the things that we have adjusted and use a conversion LUT. so you can download conversion LUT from sony website if you search for sony conversion LUT, then this page will appear and from here you can download the LUT for your sony camera right so uh, if i scroll down this is the sony look profile go to download sony look profiles and from here you can download the conversion LUT, which is for slog 2 and slog 3 just download it then you'll get this gif file and from here if you extract it you will get this LUTs. and using these LUTs, you can easily color correct your footage so let me show you how you can do that first what you need to do you need to use a input LUT from here click here and then go to browse and from here as this is a slog 3 video you need to use which is slog 3 to rec 709 right click here then open this LUT will be applied and you can see out of the box it is looking great you are getting a pretty standard starting point and from here you can adjust the color and other things right so if i show you before applying the conversion LUT, this is the footage and after applying the conversion LUT, it is making my footage much better and from here you can decrease the highlights a little bit you can decrease the blacks a little bit maybe you can open the lumetri scope and from here you can see the skin tone if you just make a mask here you can set the temperature go here the lumetri panel and from here change the tint a little bit and temperature to make the skin tone perfect so you can see the skin tone line is perfectly aligned with this skin tone line right now let's get back to effects control panel and delete the mask our video is already color corrected and from here you can adjust other things suppose you want to uh, decrease the white a little bit maybe you want to decrease the shadow a little bit you want to have a contrasty look then you can decrease the black if you want or you can actually decrease the exposure a little bit so this is the before this is the after i will increase the exposure because this is looking good to me right so you can see this is our v4 this is an after this is the video recorded using standard picture profile and this is the video that you have recorded using 
is log 3 picture profile it is looking much better in my eyes let me know in the comment section below which one you like the most if you want you you can get this look easily if you just increase the contrast a lot and if you decrease the highlights a little bit and then if you decrease the shadow a little bit again decrease the blacks then you will get the contrasty look then you can just increase the color then you will get a similar look very close to your standard picture profile right but we will not use that we will use our corrected video which is looking great in my eyes this one right from here i will just increase the sharpening a little bit then vibrance then if you want to color grade it go to here which is hl cell secondary just select the skin tone color then make it a little bit blurred you can invert the selection so that we are just selecting the background and from here we'll introduce a little bit till color So that's it that is the before that is the after so that's it now you know how you can color grade s log footage using adobe premiere pro i hope you have liked this video if you have liked this video and learned something new from this one then you can give me a thumbs up and if you need this channel want to learn adobe premiere pro video editing then you can subscribe to my channel to get more video just like this one i'll catch you guys on the next one until then goodbye